Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So on the channel, we've been talking about Google's plans to deprecate Manifest V2 extensions for Manifest V3. And that complete migration should uh, take place uh, to Manifest V3 by the end of next year, 2025. Now, in regards to this, as I posted a week or two ago, and I'll leave uh, that video linked down below and in the end screen. Google is already moving closer in the latest stable release of Google Chrome, which is sitting on version 127, to disabling Manifest V2 extensions. And one of the extensions that's been flagged already is uBlock Origin, which is a very popular choice when it comes to ad blockers, um, as you may well know, which has caused a lot of debate in certain circles. Now, um, if you want more in-depth info, as mentioned, that previous video will be linked down below in the end screen, and you can also do a search uh, regarding this topic on the channel. But just a quick recap um, regarding Manifest. Basically, it's a set of rules that defines how extensions integrate into browsers and interact with web pages. And the migration from V2 to V3 has been a long time so-called in the making. And uh, as mentioned, go uh, do a search if you want more info. Now, According to um, the developer of uBlock Origin, there is no manifest V3 based uBlock Origin. So basically what the developer is recommending, and I have seen a couple of comments on the channel already in regards to this, is recommending uBlock Origin Lite, which is manifest V3 compliant, and it's a compliant version of the extension. And basically at the end of the day, it's a stripped down version of uBlock Origin, but apparently we'll also um, get the job done. And as you can see, it's not flagged. Only uBlock Origin has been flagged and not uBlock Origin Lite. And the developer has said, and I'm quoting, Manifest uh, V2 uh, uBlock Origin will not be automatically replaced by Manifest V3 uBlock Origin Lite. So basically at the end of the day, um, the developer has said, and I'm still quoting, that ultimately whether uBlock Origin Lite is an acceptable alternative to UBO, it's up to you. So it's not a choice that you will uh, you will be made. It's not a choice that will be made for you. So just take note of that. So obviously you can fiddle around with uBlock um, Origin Lite and see if it'll get the same job done as uBlock Origin. But I'm just putting it out there because obviously um, the, the blocking of V2 uBlock Origin has caused a lot of debate and the developer is even recommending uBlock Origin Lite. So um, go check it out, fiddle around, um, and also let me know down below in the comments if uBlock Origin Lite is working, as well as um, uBlock Origin, the original uh, version of the app. And obviously, as I get information regarding this, I'll put it out there. And it's going to be interesting to see uh, if they do clamp down on uBlock Origin Lite eventually, because Google and also YouTube, as I've been posting, is clamping down on ad blockers as a whole. But um, I'll put it out there as I get more info. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.